So I'm examining a um, a UPD plate that I just made, but I I put a hole in it. Okay, and, and I had the flame right on there. Okay, and so so what we have is not like a whole bunch of metal moving in towards the heat. You can see that it's like dishing away here, right? It goes, dishes in, and gets thinner towards the hole. Okay. It didn't get thicker out here. That metal didn't like move that way. It moved this way this way and it got blown out the <laughs> right through that little hole there somewhere down here <laughs> somewhere probably right about there <laughs> and there's there's the aluminum uh, on the on the bottom of my pen um, or or it wasn't actually aluminum it was probably a u p d it is AUPD, and it has rainbows, you can see them. Get nice and close. And it also has a really nice cubic structure now, see that? Aluminum does not have a cubic structure. <laughs> so anyway, there we have it. AUPD, and what happened was we were evaporating the AUPD. Now, if, if I had um, had AUPT dust underneath it there, I could have gotten some platinum crystals out of it. You need a high temperature metal like the UPD to get a UPT. So it, it kind of works out so that you can get it all with, um, you know, essentially what works out to be um, recycled beer cans or, you know, Coke cans in my case. Except I don't drink them out of uh, a can and um, I don't drink Coke anymore either. I did for many, many, many years, which is why I don't have any teeth anymore. Even when you brush your teeth and you go to the dentist, if you drink Six Cokes a day, you do not have teeth when you are uh, an older guy like me. So I don't have teeth. And it's okay, I don't even know the difference, man. It doesn't slow me down at all. I am on a seafood diet. I see food and I eat it. <laughs>